Nick PG seven eight. What is up you guys, I am back with another tutorial. This tutorial is going to be on how to install add-ons to your Gary's Mod server. Um, this tutorial is basically just going to be installing GULX. Uh, pretty simple to install. Um, I've, as always, I'll have every link um, in the description. So here's just the link to actually US, it's like actual website, they have a bunch of stuff. As you see right here, uh, here's the actual main, um, what's it called, add-on. This is an add-on that supports that you pretty much need the ULIB in order to have ULX. Um, this is not recommended, but I have UTime. UTime is really awesome. And I don't really know what any of these threes are. <laughs> so um, when you're going down here, you can either do... I don't recommend doing it in the workshop. I mean, you can if you want to, but I just recommend just getting it because you're off GitHub. Uh, so just pretty much just click on all these links and just download any one you want. Uh, I'll be explaining these three, or well, this one, basically. Um, well, I mean, I explain all the add-ons, but this, the U-Time is not, it's optionary. Optionary, that didn't even make sense. So I'm going to download, uh, just when you click on the link, just click download zip. You will need WinWire for this. I will give you guys a link to that too, for 32-bit and 64-bit. Uh, basically, I'm just going to save all these files, and I'm going to open up the folder. Alright, I have now opened up the folder. I'm actually going to open up my Gary's Mod folder right here. You can see right here, uh, basically go to your Gmod folder, go to Gary's Mod, and then go to Add-ons on the top. As you can see, nothing's in here right now. Um, go ahead and open, actually I'll just open all these right here. Just open up, let's go with Yolex Master first. Basically open up like this, you want to click close if that pops up. And you just want to drag in Yolex Dash Master, you want to drag that in there. Wait until it transfers, all that, X out of that, and then basically do the same process for Ulib Master. So that thing's gonna pop up, X out of that. Drag ULIB dash ULIB dash master in there. X out of that. Uh, if you did do the ULX time one, go ahead and do that one too. Pretty much the same process. Cancel, open up your server again, UTime master. Alright, now pretty much all these are installed on your server. So I am going to go ahead and launch the server and I shall be right back to show you guys that it's working. BRB. Alright, what is up you guys? I am back. Uh, server is up. Let me go ahead and add a button here just to make this a little bit easier, kind of. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see now, if I go ahead and um, go on my console by typing in dash, you can also find it if you go to options, um, keyboard, and go all the way down. You should see toggle console. You can find that to any key. I have mine to minus key because that's just the key I like using it. So if I go ahead and open this up, you can bind the menu key to a bind. You can bind the menu key to one of your keys, or you can just go ahead and do it straight through here. Uh, you can type in XGY, and that will open up the menu. You can also type in, I think it's ULX menu. I think that also adds it. I'm not sure. Yeah, ULX menu. Um, you can bind this to a key, which I have. So you go bind I or whatever key you want. Quotes XGY or bind I ULX menu. Uh, I like using XGY only because I've I just figured out that there's a new command for it. <laughs> so, as you can see, when I press my bind, uh, actually, you can also do it a different way. I'm sorry, I forgot to tell you guys. Um, you can go bind I and you can go say exclamation mark menu. So now, when I type in exclamation mark menu, it'll open up or you can bind that to a key. I personally don't like it because it shows up in chat and it's really annoying. Um, sorry, as you can see, when we open this, open this uh, add on, we have a bunch of stuff in here. We got uh, we got chat commands, we got menu, user management, utility, and voting. Uh, as you see, we don't really have much to do, as it may look like we do, but we really don't. So what you want to go ahead and do is go to your, uh, what's it called? I can't think of what it's called. The CMD of your server. Um, and go ahead and type in ULX space add user space your name, your uh, Steam name, mine's Toaster. So Toaster. You don't have to spell the whole name, you can just put like the first like you know five words uh case, not case sensitive space super admin all one word no caps now as you can see it now it says console added you to group super admin uh super admins are basically the highest rank that not made you can actually make ranks that are more than that in the groups tab you can go here and go to manage groups and then you can pretty much add stuff in here um but pretty much this is the highest one that's default with ulx uh, so now as you can see, we have more things, and we got Teleport, we got Archon, we got Fun, and I do believe we got, no, that's it, <laughs> I 
So let's see, we click on one of them, it opens up a big uh, drop down of a bunch of stuff we can do. We can slay, we can freeze. So let's say I want to freeze the bot. And it says, you froze bot one, I can unfreeze him. Uh, you can armor, you can set the armor to somebody, so I can just set the armor to him like 50. And I can set it back to zero. Oh, if I can spell right. <laughs> Uh, you can jail the person by going like this, uh, seconds, zero is forever, so I just put it to five seconds. I'll jail myself for five seconds, so after five seconds I'll be unjailed. I pretty much can't do anything in jail, I can't, I can shoot people, but it has to be with a certain gun. <laughs> uh, you can whip them, which is pretty fun. Uh, if I just whip myself one time, I used to just fly in the air. Oh, or not, because the guy died, rip. Um, you got teleport, you can go to a player by typing, uh, going clicking here and going to bot whatever player you want you like to go to and I actually teleport you to the player um, you can also do all these commands in chat if you do exclamation mark um, go to and then the name you can go to them uh, you can also teleport them and do exclamation mark teleport and then the bot I, of course he died as soon as I wanted to do that uh, let me try that again once I respawn kinda want hash I'm gonna go in the death thing so he doesn't die because this bot is stupid so we try to teleport and then bot, it'll actually teleport the bot to wherever you're looking at, wherever your cursor is, uh, it's just passing out. Um, you can much do almost every single command in here, you can do the fun commands, all you can do it all in chat. So let's say I want to give myself armor, so go armor, toast, and then 100, or whatever, set the armor to yourself for 100. Uh, I can set my HP by doing so much HP, toast, and I can set it to like 555, and now you can see right here, I have 555 health. If I were to get hit by this, it only do like 10 health, or 50 actually, my bad. Um, so yeah, this that's pretty much this add-on. The other add the other add-on I I did was called ULX U Time. As you can see on the top right right now, we actually have a little UI that shows your current time on the server. It goes total and it goes session. If I go ahead and switch over to some dark RP, we can actually check this out a little bit more in depth. We can actually customize it and do all that. I'm not sure the command to actually open up if there's any command. On how to open it up easily, but we're just gonna go ahead and switch this to dark RP, which I do not have on here. Um, never mind. <laughs> uh, if you go ahead and switch to dark RP, you can actually actually change the UI. I'm not sure if you can do it without having dark RP in there, but um, it's pretty OP. Uh, it's I like it a lot. It shows you how many players are actually. I mean, let's say the player has says he has like 10 hours in the server, let's say he's trying to apply for a mod or something. Uh, you can actually go, and if he's on the server, you can actually just go up to him if you simply just look at him. Let me show you right quick. Uh, if I can find what the heck the bot is, just go to bot. There he is. Yeah, he's already here. If I look at the bot, as you can see, it, drives a little bit, it brings down a little bit of a drop down. If you, if you can stop moving, that'd be fantastic. As you can see, now it says the nickname is bot1, which is him. The total he has on the server is 5 minutes. And the session has five minutes. So if you just look at the player, you can actually see how many hours they have, see if they're lying or not. Uh, obviously, this means uh, S means seconds, M means means minutes, H means hours, D, D means day and weeks. I mean W means weeks. Um, it's pretty. It's a lot, a lot easier than trusting. Like, let's say someone just said, you know, oh my gosh, I have ten hours. Can I apply? Um, the add-on is very good for that because you can actually see if they're lying or not. Uh, I'm like like what's the word I can't even think of the word mixing up my words a lot so I apologize um but yeah that's pretty much how to install add-ons some add-ons you can't actually put them I mean you can most of the add-ons you can put in your add-ons folder but some you have to do a little bit more of effort to it uh, usually if you buy or get an add-on it usually has instructions on how to install it where to put everything and how to config it and all that um, so yeah, as always I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial I am sorry I, I Wash around my words a lot. Um, if you guys have any need any help or anything like that, please don't be afraid to put it in uh, comments. I will try my best to answer. I do get notifications on my phone when someone misses when someone comments on the video, so I'll be able to answer it fairly quickly if I'm not busy, which I'm most likely not because I don't have a freaking life. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But um, yeah. I hope you guys all have an awesome day, and I will see you guys next video. I want to get that SMG. Oh, never mind. Okay. Hope you guys have an awesome day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. What's up, you guys? Hope you guys have enjoyed that video. Make sure if you did, make sure to check out my social media names, which can be right here, or you can check out the description for the actual links. You can also check out my previous video, which is going to be right here. 
And you can also drop a sub if you guys are interested, which is going to be right here. Hope you guys have an awesome day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.